The shark lab here has done a lot of research on shark repellents. Unfortunately, all my experience with them is that none of them work. So I'm a professor of marine biology and I'm the director of the shark lab here at Cal State Long Beach. Shark lab's been here since 1969 and has actually been studying shark behavior in California and other places since then. So the bottom line is you can spend a lot of money coming up with all these devices and it may feel, make you feel more secure when you're in the ocean, but keep in mind, they may not work 100% of the time. Unfortunately, all my experience with them, and those include the magnetic ones, the electric ones, the chemical ones, is that none of them work more than 90% of the time. And when you think about it, we don't even have a birth control device that works 100% of the time, and we know a hell of a lot more about human reproduction than we do about shark behavior. The reality of it is your chances of being bitten by a shark are so small that it, it almost is crazy to think about using devices like that. While I think it's worthwhile research to continue to investigate, I, I just can't find any that I think work well enough to guarantee somebody's safety. My only other concern about shark repellent devices that are currently being marketed is sometimes when people use them, it's almost like a Superman cloak, right? They think they're invincible and they will actually do things more risky than they would normally do if they didn't have any device at all. So my philosophy is go out, use the ocean, keep having fun, do it with friends. We know it's safer that way and save your money.